Hello YouTube, it's Lovemaker, what's up welcome back to Amnesia, The Dark Descent. In the last episode, we returned finally and started making our way through the prison. And we ended in the kitchen, where we've had a fair few encounters with the grunts. But, remember I said at the, the, at the beginning of the last episode that I don't think we're going to be getting the achievement for getting all the tinderboxes? I just checked my achievement list. It says I'm close to getting that achievement. How? I'm about halfway through the game. I, there's still a fair bit to go. How am I so close to getting it? Is you only have to get a certain amount? Not all of them? I mean, um, I'll just show you. This is the achievements. Pick up every tinderbox in Amnesia the Dark Descent. And it says I'm so close. It could be because it's the closest achievements I'm going to get to because the others are hidden. So that could be why. Okay, the music's gone. He's gone. I have everything. I've been everywhere. Let's get back to that rusted padlock, shall we? I'm going to be running mostly in the dark to save as much as my lantern oils can. I've burnt through a fair bit. Yeah, storage. The storage was what led me there. This way. Nope, that's not it. Down here. Nope, not that way. I guess I'll go back down the hallway and go right. Good thing there's no stanima in this game. Wow, I cannot see shit. Okay, I think it's this way. I think I'm looking at it. That's it! Ah! Go, 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 go! What? I did not like that noise. So you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Okay. It won't budge. That lever seems to be stuck, which is probably going to let me up there. That's kind of... Oi! Okay, that just looked different to the others. Yeah, I mean, if you look at that one compared to the rest, the rest is all water, but that's not water. That's oil. That's why I pointed that out. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, I remember this. This thing's annoying because you just got to keep on lifting it up. And lifting it down till smash. Um, down that way, I believe, is the sewer system or the drainage system. But we can't go there, as they said, because one, the water is still high, and two, that poisonous type of fungi that for some reason I lost control of my character. Yeah, the poisonous type of fungi. Control room. Let's go to the control room first. <coughs> oh, again. Herbert, how did we find this place? An old friend back in Algiers gave me a map. Why isn't he with us? Didn't he want to come? 
He wanted to, Daniel, but things don't always turn out the way we planned. What was that noise? I saw I had some kind of kind of like noise. <laughs> the fuck? I remember this. It's a puzzle. Okay, let's see if there's any goodies in here. Tinderbox, lan um, oil. Tinderbox! Okay, um. Here's another one of these pipes. We're gonna need these, so I'm gonna throw that out there. Okay, we actually have to set the ones that are up in that room to match this, like a mirror image. Quick peek. Yeah, because these, they won't budge. So let's see. Uh, and then the middle. Something about that is not quite right. Okay, uh, I, yeah, they're virtually around the same height. I think the middle one needs to go up higher. Um, that should be about there, and I should have to move. There we go! Yes! Okay, give me this pipe. Put that there. Do, 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 do. I want to throw these pipes in here, because otherwise you'll be coming back for them. Okay. Alright, that one's in this one. Ah! Hello! Wooden crank. Do, 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 do. Never anything under the stairs. Why don't they ever put anything under the stairs? Don't know why it's at the top of my house. It's either work for the rhythm. Ow! God damn neck! Okay, um, in here should be... Yeah, that's... We, once again, have to match. Oil! Yay! It's basically just a puzzle game. Tin box and a letter. Or a note. Okay. Oh god damn it. Pause it if you wish to read it. That was it. Damn it. As I said, I read those off screen, so it's just that right now I prefer to just play. So hope you guys are cool with that. If not, too bad, I'm already there. <laughs> okay, um, Maybe it's not a match. Oh no, what if it's an opposite? Now that seems to send it up. So high is the sky! Okay. Yep. And... Uh, yeah! Wait, is there any pipes in here? Doesn't really look like there at all. Is that you? It's talking to us. What are you doing? I don't know. I'm an amnesiastic right now. <laughs> Who is talking to me? What is your name? What the fuck am I doing? I'm a cuckoo crazy. And I have one mental uh, note right now. To kill you. <laughs> Apparently Daniel is Mario. Mamma mia! Okay, I think we got to copy this. As said, it's just a big copy puzzle. Okay, but how many pipes do I have? Three. Strange, I thought there were four. Am I missing one? Hold on, let me count. One, two, three. That would be five. Uh, 
Let's see. Yes. Uh, this should go right. Yeah, um. Yes. And I got a big long pipe here. As you know, the long pipe seems to. If I do that. Hello! Okay, we got the pipes turning, so which means we should... The water should now be drained. That is some really happy music! What the fuck? Oh! Ah. Great throw. Ugh, it's a good thing we got a crank. Run, run, run! Do 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 I wanted to run Hmm Okay I gotta admit this is going a lot smoother than expected Uh so these leathers must deal with this so let's go to the right first or if you're coming in from the entrance, let's go to the left. Whatever works. Excuse moi. Excuse moi. Oh, right. God damn, I could be a dumbass sometimes. I remember. All right, you gotta click. And I just go, wee. It's like seven days to die. You gotta weigh it. It basically gets stuck. Yeah! You gotta wait down. I think you only need one, but I want a couple of attempts because... I suck hardcore! <laughs> yeah, the ladder mechanics aren't as... Uh, aren't that different from Seven Days to Die. Uh... Whoop! Yay! <laughs> Put it on there! That'll work! <laughs> Whoop. Okay, uh, what do we got? Oh, for fuck's sake. The morgue. I remember this place. This is one of the scare. This is one of the scariest places you uh, come up to. Believe it or not, it's actually an inter. Right. Yes, that's my f friend. I know you I don't see, play armor. Daniel, it has yielded. What? The shadow. It has? For now. Come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Peace. Where to? Just down the corridor, to the morgue. Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. Why men? Why just men? We hear that there are women. We hear them. We hear a child, a little girl, and her mom. Yet, I'm not saying like I'm disappointed there's no dead naked women lying around. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. God damn, I put myself into a corner on that one, didn't I? I'm just saying I find it weird. We hear it. There, there are apparently females being captured as well. Yet, we only ever see the bodies of dead men. Dead, naked men. <laughs> Why? I mean... Um, okay for those who like that thing, but... Uh, go you, but... I could do without living seeing a dead man's dick. What? I really can. What happened? I really can live without seeing that. Why are all these dead? Where am I? What's happening? Help! Anybody! Ah! Now something tells me he's in here dead. Probably this one, closest to the door. A copper tube. Three days now. This is ridiculous. Tinderbox! This room! Hey! Anybody! Am I all alone here? Help! Help! I'm so 
so tired. If I sleep, but I'll wake from this nightmare. If not, I pray my heavenly father will take me in my sleep. Dude, it looks like there's a way, there's actual light coming from there. It's screaming. Okay, my character's getting scared now. What's going on? Alright. Okay. Honestly, I'm really not good with the sensors thing. So I don't have like Adobe Premiere or whatnot, so I don't have like the moving images type of thing. I'd like to get that one day, but it's expensive! And I ain't one of those kinds of people that goes and uh, just goes and hacks the code and stuff like that. I'm not one of them, I'm legit. I actually paid for my ca uh, Camtasia Studios. Which, I know some people would say that was like not the best in that, but I'm actually really used to it. I know how to use it. There's probably better ways to use it than the way how I use it. Pause if you want to read. That, that was talking about, actually, you know what? I might actually want to have read that. Okay, that was talking about the vaccine. But yeah, so, there's probably better ways to use it than when I do it, but I got the hang of it. Until one day that I have enough money to buy it and I still am financially okay, maybe will I? Maybe I will buy like Adobe Premiere or something. Give me uh, some recommendations in the comments section below. I fear for Daniel, his recklessness. He is tainted by the approaching shadow. Ugh. I will not be able to pass through the gates. Will he be able to accept this in the end, my love? I've seen evil in him. How am I to trust him with the truth? What cruel irony that I have to do unto him. What Agrippa did unto me. Oops. <laughs> We've heard about this Agrippa a few times. Okay, transporting prisoner. Ooh! More lead, 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 lead. Get the box! Okay. Uh, we got a naked dead man. You know what? Since I'm not good at censoring, could I just take a book? I hear you breathing, Daniel. Do you hear me? Have you changed your mind? Have you lost your mind? Uh, how about this instead? Hey, now you can barely see his dick. <laughs> okay, that's the best censoring you get. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is it with the naked dead men? I don't like that sound. Um, it's like he was trying to crawl into there and died trying. Anything hiding between your asses? What the hell? There's flowers growing in here. That look? Interesting. The shadow. It's close now. Oh no, the shadow! It's getting cl 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 close. <sighs> okay, what's in here? Well, they died in the water. Whoa. Anything hiding between your asses? Um, hopefully not these. Okay, we're done in that. I guess that means we gotta fool around with this guy? The body is still stiff from the uh, Vega Myrants and it can't be older than a day. Okay. Hey, look at that! I actually did sensor. From this angle, you can't see it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, find copper tube in the morgue looks like a part of a surgical tool. A corpse in the morgue, only a deal. A surgical tool and a corpse. Okay. I think I know what I gotta do here. Cannot penetrate the skull. Do I drill? Why the side of his eye? The hand drill broke. The blood cannot be injected without the blood. Injected? I don't know why I just had the. You know what? Forget it. Blech. I basically injected uh, a one 
one old day dead man's blood into my body. And now we're going to hide. Hi! Say hello, everybody, to what Markiplier- Ooh! Markiplier likes to call the Moose Man! <laughs> that is what Mark likes to call the Moose Man, because he moves. I honestly don't know what he's called. You could call him the slasher with that slashing thing on his arm. We're just gonna stand here and crouch here and wait. He'll eventually go away as they all do. I wish my friend would stop going on and off of blooming the game so he would stop popping up. tends to happen a lot with him. Okay, he should disappear in a sec. Okay, he's gone. <sighs> yeah. Okay, we're done here in the moor. We've drained the water and we've, um, this way. And we've got ourselves the vaccine. Wait, then... I keep doing that. But we still haven't even gone to the right side yet, or the left side, or whatever. We haven't been over here yet. And for the looks of it, we are now more than capable of going down and moving forward, because we activated the pumps in the control room, which should have drained the water. And we've gone that way to the morgue to get the vaccine. So what's over here? Okay. I think this will be the last area I do for this episode. God damn, my sanity has took a nosedive again. You're conserving water from the spring. Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like for drinking? Hey, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like the water mill. Exactly. <sighs> okay, I guess we didn't drain the water just yet then. We actually had to get the water flowing first. Then we come here in order to activate the thing to drain the water. Now then, uh, memory serves me right, those water monsters are in here. 7th of August. 1839. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going, and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon, where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. Okay. Well, there goes one bit of the water. Okay, uh... Oh, hello. The goodies. Okay, if we jump directly into that water, we're probably going to be fucked. Well, no choice now. Whee! Was I wrong? Is there no water monsters here? 
Whatever. Hibbe! Okay. Uh, gotta be careful on my jumping because the momentum in this game is weird. 8th of August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying. But Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, really? Ah. There we go. Okay, that one's more ominous. I don't know if that means if we're done here or we still got one more, because there's still one more area we didn't go. I know time's getting on for this episode. Don't worry, guys. I'm trying. Whoop! Okay. There is water monsters, and I landed right on top of it. <laughs> well, I'm bleeding badly. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, oh, fuck off. Oh, fuck off. Fucking hell. Okay, that there is called no patience. But well, that one didn't do anything. Bizarre. And August, 1839. I think I'm still ready. It's still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all. But surely, there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. Yeah, that's the one thing I've always been a bit disappointed off about this game is that they never really did show the actual power of the orb. You know, like it's true power. There we go, cheap and plant. Pipe worker! Yay! I would have liked, say, like a sequel to the game where the game so you actually got to try to use the power of the orb. Okay. This is where we gotta run, or we die. Uh-oh! Red pulsating chits you! The shadow is coming to get us! We're dying! Get the fuck out of here! Where's, where's the door? Where's the door? I ran right past it. <laughs> fuck. The shadow is much closer than we expected. <laughs> I wonder what the actual true form of the shadow looks like. I mean, this. Uh, you know what I mean. Stuff. Stuff and things. Red pulsating things. Okay. Sanity is low. Yada yada yada. Nothing new there. Okay. And once you've done all that, access to down here is all good. But guys, this is where I'm going to be ending off the episode. Going on for just about to hit half an hour. So, I hope you've all enjoyed, and I will see you on the next episode of Amnesia, The Dark Descents. Where we're going to go into the sewers. Yay! Okay, see you then. Bye-bye!